Let's learn how to draw an image after rotation. What is rotation? Well, rotation is a turning motion. Now this triangle is turning around its center. This is a clockwise turning. And this is anti-clockwise turning. Turning in mathematics is called rotation. In order to draw the image after rotation, we need three important pieces of information. First, turn around what? Second, how much turning do I need to do? And finally, which way do I turn? To answer the first question, we will be given a center of rotation in terms of coordinates on the coordinate plane. How much turning will be given as an angle measured in degrees, and which way to turn will be given as a direction of rotation, whether clockwise or anti-clockwise. Okay, so let's say you are given this irregular hexagon, and you are given these instructions. So I will need to understand turn around what, how much turning, and which way to turn. Turn around what? I'm going to turn around the origin. The origin is the point zero, zero. How much turning? Well, I'm going to be turning 90 degrees. Which way to turn? The direction of rotation will be anti-clockwise. Let's see how that is done. For this video, you will need a tracing paper, and you can pause the video at any point in time so you can thoroughly follow the instructions. Now get your tracing paper and place the tracing paper on top of the object. Make sure the tracing paper covers the object and the center of rotation, which happens to be the origin, the point zero and zero. Next, draw a line from the point of origin along the x-axis and start tracing the object you will be transforming and trace the image with your pen or pencil. Usually when drawing, just use a pencil. Now to make sure your tracing paper doesn't slide anywhere, place the tip of your pencil on the center of rotation and then start rotating the image until the line you first drew along the x-axis goes and fits in with the y-axis so that it is exactly 90 degrees. The next step is to write down the vertices of the object of the image. So I'm going to start with the point uh, negative 1 and 1 and then I'm going to move on to negative 5 and 1, then negative 5 and 4 for this point, and then for this point, I'm going negative 4 and 4. For this point, I'm going negative 4 and 2. For this point, I'm going negative 2 and 2. And then make sure there are six vertices. One, two, three, four, five, six. And these are the vertices of our image. Remove the tracing paper and then start connecting the vertices. So, first, I'm going to connect these. And I'm going to go one vertex at a time and follow through until I draw the image and that is my image after transformation. Just make sure you do the drawing using a ruler and a pencil. Hope you found this video useful. See you next time.